Most Thank you for memorable. joining us. And we also have with us Dr. Philip Emeagwali. He's an award-winning computer scientist and inventor. He came to the U.S. from his home in Nigeria in 1974. He's listed in the Who's Who in the World and the Who's Who in America. His awards include the Gordon Bell Prize, computer science's version of the Nobel Prize, and his inventions include the world's fastest computer, which in 1989 computed 3.1 billion calculations in one second. Dr. Emir Gwali, welcome to Africa Journal. We're also glad you could join us. What is this computer uh, billion computation business? I can't even comprehend it. Yeah, first of all, thank you, my Mona, for inviting Bart and I to share our views you know, with um, Africa Journal. Well, what I tried to do in my work during the 1980s was to find a way that we can perform calculations and solve scientific problems that couldn't previously be solved by any other methods. And so what I did was to use the internet and assess 65,000 processors and perform the world's fastest computation of 3.1 billion calculations per second. And the significance is that, one, it demonstrates that we can use that technology called parallel computing to build supercomputers. And the supercomputers of today will be the personal computers of tomorrow. And of course, you know, it also helps us to recover more petroleum. And um, that's very significant because um, the economy of many countries, including Nigeria, depends on petroleum. Right, definitely. And b it's also beneficial to the petroleum industry here, of course, in the United States. And that's the reason we're talking today about brain drain. as.